welcome to Sue's Reviews. As you may have guessed, I do like my mail order plans and this one is no exception. I've been ordering this one since they were a young company and to my delight, they've made me a Pioneer member. The pack comes as a large envelope through the post and it's easy to open via a tab here. Not quite so easy one-handed. <laughs> I'll just do this off screen and then start again. There we are, there's a tab opening nicely. Inside the packet is simply your coffee and often comes with a little bit of advertising and also a card to tell you exactly what coffee's about, um, what it tastes like, some tasting notes, so it's always a good, good one to read. Also on the label of the coffee it tells you all about the coffee as well and I don't normally keep it in the pack once I've opened it, I put it into an airtight container. I normally put the card into the container so that it tells me what the coffee is, which is really handy. And as you can see, it stands up quite well, and inside is your coffee, and there's a little little vent inside there to keep it fresh as well, if you want to keep it in there. And there we are. One thing I would say about this is, if you noticed, it was roasted on the 7th of May, packed on the 10th of May by Michael and it says that you should consume it within six weeks of the roasted date. Now I don't know about all you coffee buffs out there but I just keep mine in the cupboard because actually it doesn't last six weeks. I'm quite an avid coffee drinker and that box there will probably last me about two weeks so I get a new one every two weeks. Um, so it's all freshly roasted and ground for me in um, espresso grind but you can choose lots of different grinds on their website I use an espresso maker so I like my espresso not not as strong as an espresso I like um, an Americano but I'm, I just use an espresso maker because it gives me a good first shot so I'm just going to pop this in and put it in the coffee maker And there we go, that's about the strength that I like it. Now it says this one tastes of raspberry milk chocolate and lemon and the roast profile is light. So I'm not expecting this to be a particular bitter coffee. Let's have a taste. Mm. Yeah, it's a, a mild coffee. Can I taste the raspberries, milk, chocolate and lemon? Yeah, there is a little bit of citrus there. I don't know about raspberries so much. There is a slight bitterness, but that's quite common for a, a sort of espresso type coffee anyway. But it's actually very nice. Um, one thing I would just add is that is completely recyclable, um, the outer packet. This one, it does have a um, metallised plastic lining and I haven't found anywhere yet that will take that. It says recycle other, whatever that means.